everybody, welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. Heather and I are going to do a review of a store on eBay. It's called Shoes and Fashions. So if you're searching for them, there's no spaces. Shoes, the word and is spelled out, fashions with an S. So the reason that we're doing this video is because I love buying designer shoes and when I buy them online, sometimes I find a great deal. And as you all know, I love finding great deals. So I found this store and their primary purpose is they purchase shoes that have been returned. Um, sometimes they have a box, sometimes they don't have a box, sometimes they are shoes with defects and then they resell them for a really reasonable price. They only sell designer and name brand shoes and the majority of them are anywhere from $12.99 to $16.99 plus shipping. So it's a really, really great price if you find what you're looking for. So I've gone on, I purchased seven pairs of shoes. My total was $105 because if you purchase over $70, your shipping is free. So I didn't have to pay any shipping, but now I wanna see what the quality of the shoes are, if they are brand new like they say, there are a lot of mixed reviews. They have a lot of really, really great reviews, but they also have a handful of negative reviews that say, they say they were coming with a box, they didn't come with a box. They say they were new, they were clearly used. So I'm interested to see so that I can let you know if this is a place that you should go online and shop. Heather has never gone to this shop, never seen anything before, so she's just here as another set of eyes to share with you what she thinks of the shoes and whether they are new and whether she thinks it was worth the purchase. So, I'm gonna get started with this box. I got three boxes shipped to me. And so, this is how my first box came. And so this box was open, it wasn't packed well enough to keep the items inside their box, but at a first glance, it doesn't appear that there is any damage to these. These are by Jessica Simpson. They actually did come with the box and they do look like they are brand new. They have all of their packing. Bottom of the shoes look new, a little bit of dust, but it doesn't look like they've been worn at all. And these were a really cute pair of sandals. Is it gladiator sandals? That's what we were trying to do. Yes, yes, right? Yes, I just, yes. I was like, I don't want to interrupt. Yes, gladiator sandals. Thank you. That's what it was. <clears throat> That's what I'm gonna call these them also. These are cute. Aren't they cute? They're really cute. All right, so I paid $15.41 for these shoes. They're like little gladiator shoes and they're brand new. When I looked them up online, they ran around $70 full price from Jessica Simpson. And like we said, they are new. When I purchased them, the condition stated online, new with box, and that's exactly what I got. So I hope these fit. I actually am really happy with these and I think they were a really good value and they're really, really cute. So hopefully they'll fit well, but the first pair, thumbs up, I agree. The second pair are a pair of Adidas. They did come with the box and they look intact at this point. And they have all the tags still and they're definitely brand new. Brand new. Mm -hmm. So there's no wear on them. They have the tags still attached. All right, so these shoes were $16.13, which is a great price. And they state new with box, which is exactly what I got. I'm happy with these. I think these are really cute Adidas shoes and I think they're gonna go with a lot. So let's move on to the next pair. I love those, those are really cute. All right, next pair is Katy Perry. So I did a little bit of research on Katy Perry's shoes because they did have several pairs of her shoes on this website. And these shoes in particular, when I look them up, they do run about $100, which clearly I didn't pay that. But let's see what they look like. So, <laughs> These are a blue velvet combat boot. These were the only Katy Perry shoes that they had in my size. Even though I knew they really weren't my style, I still wanted to get them and see what the quality was like and see what I thought of them. They do have a zipper on here, so it looks like they're easy on and easy off. Definitely brand new. The soles are new, they haven't been worn, so that's good news. But whether I will keep these or not, I don't know, seeing them in person, they're definitely <laughs> not my, si my style and they look a little big for me as well, yeah. even though they are a size five. 
Okay, so these shoes were $14.24 which is a really good price compared to their regular price of $100. And the title says new with box. So these are exactly as described. They are new with the box, even though the box did get a little bit wonky in delivery. Um, they still are as advertised. That's crazy, but I know. Oh, I was expecting, I didn't really know what to expect actually, because some of the reviews, like I said, were like, Terrible. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Um, the next set of shoes, the box is really dirty, but it does have a box. Um, these are Volcom sandals. And they are really cute. They are definitely new. They haven't been worn. And they did come with the box. That one even still has the tag hanging mm -hmm. from it. And these are really, really cute. They have a zip up the back. And for these, I paid $12.34, which is a reasonable price. Volcom shoes usually, well, let's see, there's actually a tag on it, $48. So these were $48 full price. So to pay $14, and, or sorry, $12.34, that's a pretty good value. And these as well stated new with box so that they are exactly as described. All right, the last pair of shoes in this box looks like They've just put them in a box. It's definitely not the shoe box that they would have come in. And these are Tory Burch heels. Tory Burch heels usually run anywhere from three to $500. And they're used. They are. They definitely, yep, they have a couple of marks on them. They have the sticky, like they were maybe had a sticker for the sale price somewhere on the bottom. It's still really, really sticky and there's lots of stuff stuck to it. So they definitely are not in perfect brand new condition. Let's see what they listed online. So these shoes were $15.19. And as you know, that's a really great price for Tory Burch since they're usually in the hundreds. And the description on these did state that they were pre-owned but well taken care of. And they say they have light wear. So I think that's actually pretty accurate. I do see the light wear. Um, I think that for the price paid, if you really wanted a pair of Tory Burch shoes, it might be worth the discount if you couldn't afford to buy a full price pair of Tory Burch shoes, or if you were only going to wear them once or twice. So I do think those match the description well enough, and I'm satisfied with that. All right. Next we have another dirty box, but a box indeed of Sam Edelman. These should be Sam Edelman boots. Those are cute. And they are, and they're so cute. So, there is a sticky note. It's like <laughs> It's like an employee was ratting the company out. <laughs> uh, we've, we've got a sticky note on the boot uh, that did come in the box. It says, this boot looks worn in, even the zipper looks used. Yeah. So that's an interesting little side note. But, but the bottoms look brand new. Yeah. They don't look used at all. And they have the box. So let's see what the listing stated. Hilarious. That is like an employee being like, <laughs> before they show you know. <laughs> I hate my job. <laughs> and it does have its stuffing in it even still. So this shoe was, or these boots were $16.14. I can tell you that these boots, if you want to buy them from Sam Edelman, are $150 because the reason I actually made the purchase from this company is for this pair of boots. I've wanted these boots for a while, but I really didn't want to pay $150 for them. So when I saw that they had them on this website for $16.14, I was going to make the purchase. However, the shipping was $8.99, and I hate paying shipping. So I started looking into what I could do to avoid paying shipping, and from this store, if you spend $70, your shipping is free. So this was actually what I made my purchase initially for, and the description states, pre-owned, it states that it, they don't have the box, but they do, which I'm actually really happy about. I do like getting the box when they have it. And it says light wear, creases, marks, and or scuffs. I don't see any Hardly, yeah. 
creases or scuffs. Um, the only thing really that I can see is, I think it's on that boot, there's one spot next to the zipper and the little zipper pull. I mean, maybe it looks a little, I don't know, it's not that bad, no. but it's definitely worth the discount on the shoes because no one else would even notice. And actually, the place that there's a little bit of a mark is covered by this little strap that goes around anyway, so no one else would ever even notice. So I'm very happy with this purchase. I was looking forward to getting to this pair of shoes. And we have one pair net left. I like those a lot. Those are really, really cute. Okay. Oh, like this. These are Franco Sarto boots, gray, tall boots, and they're super cute. They don't have the box. This is a different box that they sent them in, it looks like, uh, but they do look brand new. There's no wear on the sole, and they look nice. Yeah. Does that one look good? It looks good. These are cute. Those are really cute. These boots were $16.13. Franco, Franco Sarto boots generally run around $150. I looked them up online. This is actually the first pair of Franco Sarto boots that I've purchased. I know that they sell a lot of Franco Sarto shoes at Nordstrom. I've seen them there before. I've just never purchased any. And these look really cute and I've been looking for some gray boots. So I'm happy that they came in great condition. So the description on these state new without box and that appears to be exactly what they are. So the reason that I wanted to do this video is because, like I said, when I was re looking at the reviews, there were a lot of mixed reviews. There were a lot of um, things where people stated that they didn't get the box or that there were defects or things like that. And I think it's because they didn't actually read the description. The description is very clear stating what you're gonna get. And I feel like what every description stated is what we got. Mm -hmm. And I'm actually really happy some of these shoes I'm looking forward to wearing and excited about. I can tell you already after opening them, there's probably a couple in here that I may not wear and may return, which by the way, this store does accept returns, or I may pass them along to someone else that wears the same size as me that I think may be interested in them. Unfortunately, that's not me. I know, I wish it was. Yeah. <laughs> because I'd be giving you those Katy Perry boots. Oh. I'd be expecting you to wear them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed our video. Thank you to Heather for coming along as well to give her opinion on them and for finding that funny sticky note on <laughs> the boot. I love the boots, so I'm happy that I finally got them. I like some of the other shoes as well and look forward to wearing them. But if you're looking for designer shoes at a discount price, this is the place to go. So if you go on eBay and do a search for a store, remember it's called Shoes and Fashions. Their feedback is like 99.5% positive because they do have some negative reviews and some neutral reviews, but I give them a five star on everything. I will be leaving them a great review. And if you're interested, go on and check them out. They do have some great prices. The other thing they have going on right now is with all of their sale shoes, which all of these are in their sales section. If you buy two pairs, your third pair you get 20% off. So that was additionally why with the prices I told you, I only ended up paying $105 for them because I ended up getting two pairs of shoes at 20% off, which was an additional discount. I hope you enjoyed our video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye. And your battery is on right <laughs> at the very end. Perfect timing. Perfect.